Okay, so all the rows are sewed together. See? Then what I did was, I they look kind of like this before, but I opened the seams and I ironed them flat. So nice and flat. So all of them are ironed flat. Once they're ironed flat, make sure you have them in the right order. Then you're going to sew your rows together. So I take, you can do either way. I'm going to take my top row to my middle row. Remember, right sides together. I want to match up my seams. So I look here and I look here and make sure they match. And I slide it there. And it may not be perfect if your cut's not super perfect. It's okay. But this matching is most important. Can you see under there? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it matches. Perfect. Okay. Then you pin it. The reason why you, you iron those flaps down is because you're going to sew the flaps down. It just makes it nice and flat. I like to pin it right there, too. Okay, and then I'm going to come back in the machine. Okay, so five eighths again. See, I'm not perfectly lined up there, but that's okay because I just want to make sure my seams are, though. Seams. Most important. Five eighths. Put it in there. Don't forget to reverse. Come to a pin, take it out. Keeping that five eighth. You're straight. Oops. Okay, thread take up lever all the way up. Mm -hmm. Lift my presser foot, slide it out. And let's look what this looks like. There you go. Wow. And I know, teeny tiny bit, but nobody's going to notice. Okay, so make sure those, and then you're going to do the same thing with this. So line up those again. Scoot them down. And I'm going to sew, I'm going to pin and sew that one too. So when it's all done, it'll look like that. The end.